what's up welcome back to my channel it's Nina if you were new here welcome so happy that you're here if you're not new what's up hope you guys are doing well I'm glad you came back for another tutorial today we are continuing with evermore and we are going to be learning cowboy like me and this song was third in the poll I'm just kind of going in order eventually I'm gonna get to all the songs I have made tabs for all of them and then she adds two deluxe songs to my list so it's gonna it's gonna be a while so be patient I'm gonna try to keep doing two videos a week so that I can catch up but today we are doing cowboy like me and honestly this song really has to grow on me because it's just kind of really slow and she has a lot of good one-liners in this song I will say like sometimes I will listen to the first verse and then I'll skip I know people are gonna come for me in the comments but it's interesting to me that a lot of people like this is their favorite song on the album it is interesting to me but honestly after doing a tutorial for a song I have a new appreciation for it I really do because I get to look at the lyrics and like sing it over and over again and then I'm like oh like I really like that song so we'll see this song is very simple simple strumming simple chords the only thing is that it, the structure of it is kind of weird but we'll go over that if you haven't seen my other evermore tutorials go ahead and click the link up there I've made a playlist of all of them and if you want to see the tab that I wrote for this song go ahead and click the link in the description box it will take you to my website where I post all the tabs so you can download and play along with me so let's get into the video if you guys don't know, I have the original Taylor Swift guitar strap on this guitar. It's kind of funny. If you want to know where I bought that, the link is in the description box. Okay, so this song can be played without a capo or with a capo on the fifth fret. And I was trying to decide which one I liked better. The reason I'm gonna choose the one with capo on the fifth fret is that these chords are just a little bit different than what I normally teach because I feel like I've been teaching the same chord progression over and over again. So this is just something different because I'm sure there's other tutorials out there that will show you the way without a capo. But I will include both tabs on my website. So I will have a tab that has a no capo and a tab that has with a capo on the fifth fret so you can have those they're played the same way the chords are just different yes they're it's the same key it's just transposed so basically like if I didn't have a capo and I played D minor it sounds like that but if I put a capo on the fifth fret and I play a minor it sounds the same magic but basically that's why you can play it two different ways with no capo or a capo on the fifth fret and I'm gonna be teaching the way with a capo on the fifth fret the chords you're going to need for this song are a minor D G C and then you're gonna need E minor and B minor in the bridge the chords for the no capo version are your classic like C F sus 2 G sus 4 so if you want to know that way go click the link in the description box so for this one it doesn't have an intro it just goes straight into it it's like in the tennis chords so for the verse the chord progression is going to be a minor D G C and you're gonna play that four times for the verse the strumming pattern is going to be down 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 up switch down 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 up switch 
and that's the strumming pattern for the whole song. So I'll play that a little bit slow and play along with me. So we have A minor. So you're going to play that four times, so I'll sing the first part of the verse, so we have A minor. And the tennis courts were covered up with something that thing. And you asked me to dance, and I said, dancing is a dangerous game. I think that's my favorite line of the whole song. Ooh, dancing is a dangerous game. Love that. And then so you keep, keep going with that. And she says, I'm never gonna love again. And then it goes to the chorus. Now this song kind of has like a couple different like chorus parts that like repeat. So just take note. So for this chorus part, it's going to be C, G, C, D, C, G, C, D. And then when it says cowboy like me, it's gonna be A minor and then D and then into the next verse. And it's the same strumming pattern. So we've got C, down, 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 up, G, down, I'll sing that slowly. I got some tricks up my sleeve. Takes one, two, no one. And then it goes to You're a cowboy like me. And then it goes into the next verse. And at the end of that line, it goes straight into verse two. So what it's gonna sound like is, you're a cowboy like me. Never wanted love, just a fancy car. And then technically verse two is the same as verse one, like strumming and chords wise, but the A minor and D start at the end of the cowboy like me line. So it's just like kind of continuous. So for verse two, when it says never wanted love, it's gonna go to G. So we've got cowboy like me, A minor, D, and then G, C. And then we have that again. So it's like a short little verse two. They kind of merge from the chorus into the second verse. I hope that makes sense. And then it goes right back into the chorus. You And on this cowboy like me is going to be a different thing because it goes into this like second part of the chorus because this part repeats later. I don't know. Anyways, so we do that whole thing, chorus, and then you're a cowboy like me, first in the dark, telling all the rich folks anything they want to hear. That part. So the chord progression for this part is going to be C, D, G, G. So you're going to play G twice there, like two measures, and then it's going to go C, D, G. I hope that makes sense. I'll put them all here. And it's going to be the same strumming pattern, so I'll sing the second half. You're a bandit like me, eyes full of stars, hustling for the good life, never thought I'd meet you here. We could be love, we could be the way for it, and I know I'll pay. After this, it's gonna go into a kind of long instrumental break. So for this instrumental part, it's going to be A minor, D, G, C, and you're gonna do that twice, and it's gonna have a series of like, ooh, oh, like O's, like background vocals, and then after that, you're gonna do C, G, C, D, C, G, C, D. So you do each of those lines twice and then it goes into the post-chorus thing again. So after the second time it does that, it's gonna go into the bridge. And for this part, it's gonna change a little bit. The chords are gonna be different. We're gonna have E minor, B minor, D, A. And you're going to do that four times. Strumming pattern is the same as before. Um, so we've got... And the skeletons in the closets plotted hearts and I need work on the melody of the bridge, <laughs> but you get the point. And then I'll do the second part. And the ladies lunch and have the stories about when you pass through town. But that was all before I locked it down. 
so that part when it goes locked it down, you're gonna single strum D and then A. And then there's a little bit of a pause before it goes into verse three. Verse three is gonna be the same as the first two verses, obviously. Oh, this line has is tied with the other line for my favorite. Forever is the sweetest con. That's a good one. And then it goes into the chorus part where it goes I had some tricks up my sleeve And after it goes to no one, it comes to the outro So for the outro, we've got G, C, D, G G, C, D, G, all the way until it's done So I'll just play that part You're a cowboy like a man. A series of like O's and then and then it goes through them one more time and then it ends on the G and that's the whole song that's actually much more simple than I thought it was gonna be it's just kind of like goes straight through very seamless yeah I do think that I'll be listening to this song more after this if you want to see the full playthrough of me singing the whole song and putting all the chords up on the screen you could click the link in the description box or up here to go to my music channel I post all the playthroughs on there so I don't get demonetized in these videos for singing the whole song so yeah go check that out if you want to play through the whole song with me thank you guys for watching I hope you guys like this video give it a thumbs up if you did and if it helped you learn the song don't forget to subscribe because I make new videos every Tuesday and Friday go ahead and turn on those post notifications so you don't miss when I upload and right now the day that I'm filming this I am almost at 10k so hopefully by the time I post this I have 10k but right now I'm at almost 9.7 so spread the word tell your friends and I will see you guys in my next video Bye.